City of Des Moines has unveiled a preliminary design for a $10 million makeover of the Birdland Park area. The plans have generated a lot of buzz for the area and the park will be designed and built as a regional city park, sort of like Gray's Lake. WHO 13's Roger Riley has been looking into this. He joins us now. We wanted you to be live, but it's a rotten day for it, Roger. Yeah, decided to come in here with you guys. Yeah. This park will be transformed from a marina, Aaron, which used to flood to a destination for people even from outside the city of Des Moines. Yeah, so um, the park is all about uh, nature-based outdoor recreation. Um, so, of course, we have the Neil Smith um, National Recreation Trail. We're adding a couple open air shelters to that trail facility on the west side. We'll have grill pits, bike racks, all those good things. Um, and each one will have a little wetland overlook and a view of the river. Now, this $10 million project will include areas on the east and west sides of the park. There will be an ice ribbon, kind of ice skating, and new play areas included in the Neil Smith bike trail, which is already there, will be raised, so it's not prone to flooding. This project is part of an even larger $54 million master plan, which would include dredging the lagoon and more than doubling the size of the marina. The first phase of the park project is designed to complement other outdoor attractions nearby. And again, when you look at all the mix of recreational offerings, either immediately within Birdland or immediately adjacent to Birdland, you know, you think about the 600 plus mile Central Iowa Trail System. You think about the Lords and Skate Park, which is just right down the trail down the road, one of the largest skate parks in the nation. You think about the developing Icon Water Trails. Birdland is right at the heart of all these different things. And right at the heart of Birdland is Roy's, Captain Roy's Bar. It's uh, right there. They didn't really want to comment today to say too much other than that they are very excited about this uh, development with the park. Uh, they'll stay busy as usual with bikers on the Neil Smith Trail. Now, in the, if the fundraising and planning Aaron goes as planned, uh, they could start building this in about a year. Okay, can't wait. We'll keep an eye on it. Thanks, Roger.